Okay, so here we are in virtual reality again in VR patients, and we're gonna do a new feature today. We're gonna cover vagal maneuvers. So cool, we're gonna go into this SVT patient because we know, as paramedics, BLS before ALS, right? So I'm on the scene, and I'm looking at this guy, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna throw you on the monitor right quick. I know for an SVT, that there's an algorithm I can follow, right? I'm looking at the monitor straight up, 172 beats per minute. That is tight, that is quick. I can pull out my stethoscope and I've listened to your lung sounds. I'm listening to your heart rate. Holy guacamole, that's a fast heart rate. So what am I gonna do first? As a competent paramedic and a new paramedic, we'll say as a new paramedic, I am drug happy. I wanna, I wanna give you drugs like crazy. That's what new medics wanna do, right? Put a line in them, give them drugs, because I just learned these skills. And I'm excited to use them. But a competent paramedic will look at you and go BLS before ALS. And while my partner's putting a line in you, sir, I would like you to bear down, right? We're gonna get that line in you. And before I give you drugs, before I start, stop your heart and chemically convert you with adenosine, which is a naturally, naturally occurring nucleoside, so he's not gonna be allergic to it, but we'll ask you for your allergies before I give you any meds. But before I go down that road, I wanna do a vagal maneuver, right? Well, can I do that in VR? Procedures? We're not gonna do compressions. He's, he's talking, he's walking, talking. He's okay right now. Vagal maneuver, so I click on it, watch him plugs his nose, he bears down. I would coach him through this as a paramedic. Sir, here's what I want you to do. What happened? Oh, look at that. His pulse went down 12 points from 172 to 160. So we're actually seeing in real time things change just like they would in real life. Let's do it again in a second. Let's wait till his heart rate comes back up because clearly that didn't work. And I would be putting a line in you right now, giving you the adenosine and getting you to the hospital to get you better, sir. All right, your pulse is back up to 172. Now, sir, I want you to bear down. So I need you to take a deep breath, plug your nose, and blow out your nose as hard as you, as hard as you can. Not too hard, but pretty hard, right? And you're gonna bear down, push that air all the way down. Because what's my goal? I want all of that air to push down in your diaphragm, and I want you to push on your vagus nerve. And this is why people pass out when they're bearing down on the toilet. So don't bear down on the toilet, guys. Right? That's how Elvis Presley died, among other things. So, I want you to bear down. Okay, sir, so here we go. I want you to take a deep breath, plug your nose, and bear down, push that air down. Ready? Go. Here he goes. Hoop. Very realistic, just like in real life. Now, there you go, and you're watching on the monitor, I can actually see a reaction down to 160, again. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys that incredibly realistic feature in virtual reality. See you on the next one. Happy training. Thank you so much for watching another Skills Station video. Please click on the red subscribe button and then click on the bell to get notified when exclusive content drops. Comment below, let us know what you like and dislike, and I cannot wait to see you again in VR. See you on the next one. Just hanging out? Not sure if you're gonna go to the next video? Maybe click on one of these, huh? Did you hit subscribe yet? You should. We got some good stuff for you.